Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Keith and welcome to my review of the movie Hacksaw Ridge. The new movie starring Andrew Garfield, Teresa Palmer, Sam Worthington and Vince Vaughn. No, it is not a comedy, it is a drama, it is set during World War II and Andrew Garfield's character is Desmond Dawes, based on the real life soldier. Now Desmond Dawes is a conscientious objector, which is a nice way of saying he's a pacifist. While he understands the importance of the war, he doesn't believe in picking up a firearm but he wants to go and serve his country as a medic. Now this is met with a lot of skepticism by the US Army and his fellow uh, platoon, uh, platoon mates, but eventually he gets his wish. Now we've seen Andrew Garfield in movies such as Spider-Man and such as The Social Network, but I will submit that this is the best Andrew Garfield performance that we have seen to date, to the point where he is even being considered for a Best Actor nomination for this role. Now, the interesting thing about this movie is it's directed by Mel Gibson. That's not so interesting in the fact that, I mean, Mel Gibson's a, an Academy Award winner in his own right, but it seems that the promotion of this movie seems to be distancing itself from Mel Gibson. Normally, you, they would come out and they would say directed by Mel Gibson, but in this instance, they're saying directed by the Academy Award winner of Braveheart. You mean Mel Gibson? Anyways, I congratulate Mel Gibson for getting the absolute best out of all of the actors and actresses in this film, including and especially Andrew Garfield. It's like he was able to, to tap into some, 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 some hidden talent that hadn't really been brought out before, and I'm sure that this role will lead to more, uh, more and more exciting roles for, for Mr. Garfield. Um, I'm sitting watching this movie, and I'll be honest with you, I'm thinking of other great war movies like Saving Private Ryan. The, the, the fight scenes are, can sometimes be a little long, but they're very intense, and they came off to me as very realistic. They did a very good job of capturing the destruction and the mood that, you would, that, that would take place during a war, and I think the realism in this movie is very authentic. Um, congratulations to Mel Gibson, yes, I'm gonna say his name, on doing a fantastic job with this, and I definitely recommend you go and check it out. I give this movie a B plus. I definitely hope you have the opportunity to check it out and let me know what you think. As always, you can reach out to me at CFL underscore fan on Twitter, facebook.com slash witty wittier and witty wittier dot com. I appreciate your time. Thank you so much. My name is Keith and I'll see you at the movies.